It's 8.30 on Monday morning, and to kick off week three, Sally's on her way to Elstree Studios in Middlesex for her next celebrity reading. Reading for this lady. Oh, wow! She's lovely, Lisa Scott Lee. I know her, the ice skater. Lisa Scott Lee found fame in Steps, one of Britain's most successful pop acts. She's gone on to host her own reality TV program and more recently starred in Dancing on Ice. But can Sally reveal anything about Icy Cool Lisa? I'm not, I'm not nervous at all, no, I'm quite relaxed about it. Um, I, I don't think I should be nervous, should I? <laughs> Hello, how are you? Oh, very pleased Lisa. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Lisa, isn't it? It is, yeah. Alice. Hi, I Sally. saw you on, on ice. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Aren't you clever? Thank you. It's been brilliant. Um, now, I'm a medium. I don't know if you know that. Yeah. I'm, I've, I was pre-warned. <laughs> oh, right. OK. Um, because you've got a man standing here and, um, you know, loves you very much and just wants um, very... Wants she, really wants to let you know that certain decisions that you've made with your personal life recently, like I've been watching, and that he's behind you with certain things there. OK. Um, and, um... Who's Tony? It's my dad. You're, this man here is around your father, so this man is related it's, to Debbie. Yeah, it's my granddad. Yeah. I was like really close to my granddad. Well, he loves you very much. Do you know what he says to me? Look at this. He wants you I to know. <laughs> he said to me, we can get you one. Yeah. He said to me, I was, he said, it was so easy to part. He went, I was like this. It was like stepping in a warm bath. He said, he came up my legs, warmth, 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 closed my eyes, put my head to the left. Yeah. And his mum came for him. Oh. Yeah, I was with him when he died. And he says that it, he, that's why he wants you to know, because he could see how upset yeah. you got when he... It, we're going to get you a tissue now, yeah, sweetheart. Can somebody we are going to pass you a tissue <laughs> through on the camera, so it's all real. Everyone can... It's a clean Thank one, you. sweetheart. Cheers. And he... Um, it's still because... beautiful, darling. Don't worry, even though you've got some tears there. <laughs> oh, I don't mind. Because I was so close to him. And, um, yeah, I was with him when he died, so it's a bit painful. Of course it is. Of course it yeah. is. Yeah. yeah, he he's also there next to him are two little boys. Yeah, my, well, my nana she she lost um, she lost two babies. So. Oh, that would have been his wife. Yeah. Yeah, there he's, he's with them, his sons. Mm. These are two little boys standing here, and he's with George. That and was his brother. He's with George, God. and he says he says George is he says. Do you know what he says? We're all here. Look at us all sitting here. Wow, he says to me, someone died of a heart attack. It was very, very quick. Right. And someone was standing there, and then they were just there, and someone it just picked them up, held them like that, and they passed. Do you know who that was? Yeah, yeah, I do. That was my, my uncle. It, it's a bit like the person that passed, he would, he, he would rather have died like that. He said that was a good yeah. way to go. You've got two ladies standing behind you as well. Mm. And I think one of them is a grandmother of yours. Yeah. And I think she may be with her sister. And it's like one is in front of the other. Yeah. Your nana, she wants to say to you, she's happy because she's with her boy. OK. And she says that when he went, I, it was like my life wasn't worth living, so now I'm with him. Because she really had a problem coping. I know. Without your uncle. Oh, dear. I don't want her to give me the message because I don't want to upset you. I literally, I've just, I lost my nana in November, well, October. Let's borrow your tissue. Cancer. And, uh, yeah, she got diagnosed with it six weeks before she died, so it was, it was really quick. And uh, I wanted to see Dancing on Ice. Yeah, well, she did see you. Did she? Oh, yeah. God. Honestly, that just gives me so much comfort to know that. Does it? I know I'm, I'm crying because I love them very dearly. And, um, you know, it's hard when you lose people, but yeah. it's great to know that they're together. Mm. Yeah, that was really good. Yeah. Um, you're yeah, going to have a family, you know, not yet, but you can have a family. 
Good time this morning. Yeah, and I, I <laughs> want to do exactly. And I want to. Have you got a photograph of your boyfriend? Yeah. Can I have a look? Yeah. There you go. You're gonna have a baby. Mmm. <laughs> a little boy is gonna be born. Do you know when? Mmm. <laughs> You'll con you won't conceive at home. Mm -hmm. You'll conceive away from home. Wow. Well, we've got holiday booked. <laughs> Have you? Yeah. Guess better be careful. Is that in six weeks' time? <laughs> yeah, it is. Mm. Oh, God. <laughs> Do you have, a, um, like, a, a wallet, like a red wallet that belongs? I've got an orange one. Have you? Yeah. That one? <laughs> Yeah. Do you keep something like lucky in here? Yeah. I do. You are having a laugh. No, are you so No, seriously, I've got a lucky star. That's your granddad that told me that. Oh, I've got all emotional now. Oh, God. That is unbel that is unbelievable. It is. Oh, we're all crying. Here. <laughs> Everybody's crying. It's Everyone's not, it's not just crying. Me. They're all happy tears. It's just so overwhelming because you you were spot on. You really were. When you have a reading like that and somebody knows so much about you, um, I, I just think that, you know, I don't know how people can be cynical when you've seen the proof like that, really.